machine-assisted communication is one or more people communicating using a mechanical device or devices. The source and the receiver do not have to be in the same physical space. And the elements of communication become more complex and the sender can be one or more people. The encoding may have to take many different forms, usually a combination of mental and technological encodings. Mechanical encodings add complexity to the communications process and increase the risk of failed communication. The more times a message is encoded, the greater chance of noise or error. And the channels in machine-assisted communication are mechanical or technological. Examples would be a telephone, email, instant messaging, text messaging. Now the messages can be private or public depending on what channel you use and they're easily terminated by ending contact with the channel. And the issue with decoding is as complex as encoding with the great possibility of noise creeping in. Think of the times you've tried to call someone on the telephone, but they weren't home. Or you sent an email that someone never received. Or your text message wasn't properly translated. Receivers can be known or unknown, and they could be unintended. The chance of unintended receivers increase with the use of technology. In machine-assisted communication, feedback can be either immediate we could be having a phone conversation. I could get angry and hang up. It could be delayed. You could send me an email and it might be days before I respond. Or it might be impossible. The lack of feedback in machine-assisted communications can be unsettling. When you send me an email, how do you know that I got it? That's why I've created a method to send automatic replies. At least you'll know I received your message. The noise can be environmental, semantic, or psychological. This still is from a video on website and shows in 30 seconds the range of potential problems in machine-assisted communications. There are problems with encoding, decoding, senders, receivers, noise, and feedback.